What's up you guys? Welcome to Break From Reality. I'm here with Peter from Uncomfortably Fresh. Usually on Break From Reality, I'm teaching somebody else, but today he's teaching me a move that I've never learned or really attempted successfully, which is the air flare. We're doing that today? Yes, we are. I met Peter when we were younger, and this was at a time when everybody was doing air flares, and I, in my mind, I was like, everybody's doing it. I don't want to do it. And I literally have refused to air flare since then until Peter convinced me. Finally, we got him. So again, my name is Peter from Uncomfortably Fresh Crew. I've been dancing for about 12 years, and this is the day I've been waiting for. This. <laughs> Give him air flares for you guys. So right now we're starting and I want to explain to Vince for air flare, the catch is really important. So that, I'm gonna explain that to him right now. So what you want, what you say, you say counterclockwise, right? Yeah, counterclockwise. Counterclockwise, okay, so your right hand, that's gonna be important. And most people think that you can just throw your arm and just hope to goodness that you catch it. You're familiar with full extension of the shoulder. Uh, where this is, this is just you lifting your hand, full uh -huh. extension is. Like you're reaching through the ceiling. Yeah. And for just all intents and purposes for today, try to keep your head close to your arm like that. Because like, that way, you're stacked. Like pull my arm closer or leave my head closer? Like push your arm into the ceiling and then you lay your head on your arm. Oh, okay. Just for now, yeah. And you notice how it kind of lines up your whole body? Yeah. That's going to be your catch. Okay. When there's momentum involved, it's going to pull you away. So that's why we want to stay here. Because this will happen. Hollow backs. Hollow backs, you got, you, you knew hollow back. Like a little basic Yeah, one. yeah. All right, so how do you hold your arms for hollow backs? Okay, so that's gonna be really advanced when we're working on like this type of air flip, the high ones. So mm -hmm. we're just gonna go like here, like one of those hollow backs where you just, I don't even know what that's called. Like the usher hollow back? Yeah, the usher, yeah, the usher hollow back. So it's usher hollow back. That, this is what we're aiming for. So, full extend, stick your chest out, and you notice that we're not looking at our hands, right? Keep your, keep your head forward like this. Try to touch your chin to your chest even. Cool. Alright, now we're gonna try this out. So, uh, do a tornado for me. <laughs> Alright, cool, cool. Do that illusion one more time. Um, leg spread. Alright, cool. Now, you know how when you do a flare, you swing this, like you swing the whip leg around and then you wanna lift it up like this by kicking it to your chest? So do that illusion one more time. When you open your legs, try to focus on this uh, left leg and like bring it towards your chest. Usually someone will go up and just open their legs like this. Which is, it'll work, but we want this a little bit more active. We want that flare motion that's like, it's a hold. So get here and like oh, I try to pull cool. that down a little bit. Oh, it's almost like a, like I'm a plant kind of. Almost, almost. But just stay up in a handstand. So. Yeah, see how much stronger that was already? Yeah. Like right when you did that, everything just set in place. Try it one more time. It's stable, huh? Yeah, it's super yeah. stable. All right, can you do that? And then add a, add a walk, add a walk. In, in that position? Ish. So you don't have to hold the position, you kind of just activate it and you go from there. Oh, and then go from there. Okay. Yeah. So do, I need, do I need the air flare uh, top rock? Oh, yeah, we need the air flare top rock. You need to swing your arms like this and it gives you extra power. Trust me, trust me. I am ready. Trust me. I saw this on breakdance.com. Okay. Nice. Is that it? Yeah, did you feel like, you know how when you do a hand hop, like you engage it and then you kind of just relax and it'll hop you? Yeah, So yeah. that's what that did. But like you just tightened it for a second and then right when you like released it, it kind of just went for you. Yeah, yeah. So it's like a hand hop idea. Engage, let go and reach. Engage. Oh crap. Is that it? Um, we missed, we missed the this. Oh crap. 
you notice like this kind of does like bounce. By just going like this, it, it, it wants to bounce right out. So that's what that motion was for. Because if you just hold it, then you just hold it. It doesn't really give you anything. Like then you have to do all the work. Um, but if you just try to bring this down just a little, you don't even need it that close. You just tell yourself, bring it down. Because once it unpikes, you're gonna go. So it's like, pull. Yep. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you notice it's on two hands. You're not like, it's just a two handed move. Yeah. Yeah. Feel better? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's like the huge key of it. Two handed and, a, and, a, and a, like a little assist. Cool. All that does is help set you in motion for the momentum that everyone like says to do. They just say whip hard, it's not really a whip. Not right, yet right. anyway. I don't really know how to do an illusion. I just figure it's like walking in a circle. Perfect, okay. So it's that walking in a circle, right? See if you can, when you place the your right hand down, so it's, so yeah, like try, try to like yeah, turn it in like this, and place it behind your head like this. So you're not you're not going evenly like this. You're actually just trying to put it behind. So here, huh? Boom. Yeah. So you don't even you don't even have to turn. Don't even worry about the turn because just by. If I were just to do a straight movement with my hand, uh -huh. so I'm upside down, right? The turn is happening. I'm just putting, shooting this hand straight back like this. Uh, yeah, because it's because it's gonna set you there. Once you touch that, it's it's gonna take everything around. So should I just do one? Try to do one. Yeah. Okay. So it's go slow. It doesn't need to be fast at all. Behind your head. Yeah. You know it's like how quick like it, it's stuck. It, you didn't even have to turn, but once when you stuck it, then your body started following you already. So you go boom, and that's it. Oh, okay. So not this wide, same thing. You aim behind, and then once you stick it, just see if you can hold it. What we're aiming for is this, this chest guy to point it to the sky. So illusion to Usher hollow back. Usher hollow back, yeah. Oh shit. Cool. So uh, you can point your fingers together, then you'll be able to stick it a little better. So what you're doing, um, there's no stick yet. So it's good, it's here, and you go. And it's uh, right there. So I want to turn it together. Uh, yeah, and that's all it is. It's light around, stick. Boom, boom. Ah, okay, I see what it is. Remember that you had to use this leg? Yeah. So this one is automatically doing it, so that's what, so it's pulling you down. Oh, okay. So I guess the reason why I do this is because that leg for me is automatic too, so I'm, tr I'm, I'm, I'm like trying to counterbalance it. Oh. Yeah. Yep. Okay. That, that felt better. What did you do different? I think I did, I think I was like trying to swing too hard Before? into it. Yeah. Yeah, see? Everything you learn is not 100% true. <laughs> <laughs> Alternate airflare packs. Right. Did I, I don't know if I arched my back. The, the back will happen um, once this arm gets fully extended. Oh, like okay. It will have to do it. But if you land, boom, just like this, um, it will not. So that's why you tell yourself, Ugh. If, if it's too wide, it's also really hard because then it's like, can't find the ground. So you just aim as close as you can behind your head. Because uh -huh. then everything, see all the, the shoulder transfer? Yeah. It yeah. will just do it itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you see how it caught right there? And right when you hit that, you just uh, all right, yeah. you can kick whatever you want. Let me try again. It's all about the catch. Push! <laughs> a little better? Yeah. Did you feel did you feel a? Yeah, yeah. Alright, cool. One more time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like any all brother moves, right? It's like, I know I'm doing it. I gotta take a step into it. Just not like, oh my gosh, I hope I catch it, right? Mm -hmm. So when you put this hand, tell yourself, it's, it's, gonna, it's gonna be straight. There's no catch and then extend. It's done and extended. Yeah, did you notice those, those like, it was pretty light, it was lighter. Yeah. Cool. Okay. 
Yeah. 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 And what 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 was going on here? What was going on right here? Uh, I think I just felt locked, like it was like locked, and then just twisting like this. It's locked. You don't have to do anything, right? It's no. just like I mean, this is happening, but like all this muscle tension, it's just like it, it's like in a strongest point. Yeah, yeah. That's what we're going for. Mm. So we're gonna try to combine it now. He's gonna start. He's gonna start his illusion, and when he shoots his hand behind, he's gonna go for like for a full lock. Huh? Oh. Stable? Yeah. Stable one more time. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. That was the closest one I've seen. <laughs> boom, boom. <laughs> boom, boom. Oh crap. Just to recap, it's illusion, arm behind the head, and full extension. And lock it. Yeah, full and lock it. And remember, when we're going for this, it's kind of like a hollow back. You want to point the fingers together. Just for now, it's gonna it's gonna change later. But this is to this is to facilitate the chest outward because that's what's gonna help get you over. Because uh, if you're in like this, you, you can't you can't really turn to get out. But if, it's, if it sticks out, it's already like going that way. Yeah 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 yeah. Push. Push and go upward. <laughs> oh crap, that's that start. So chill, chill. I'm so really with, rushing. So with all those, you notice it's it's just a step, right? It's just a step with your hand. Yeah. It's yeah. just a step. Like we're not jumping. Even when you start doing the wide ones, it's not like a jump. Because you you don't want you don't want that. You just want a nice little transfer. Yeah. So what makes it look like a jump is a more intentional like yeah, 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 yeah. So that's the catch. That's how you catch it. And then we want to make it look more like an air flare. That transfer is more, I wouldn't say faster, but a little more instant. Instead of hand, hand, out. It's like hand. Like you're just you're just kind of re replacing it. It's hard to go like that versus going. I'm just gonna replace that. Oh, yeah. So that's why we're going behind the head. Up and then try to get closer. Try to get closer. Closer. Yeah, yeah. That was light, right? Yeah, yeah. Because when you stuck, you're just <laughs> you're completely like this. <laughs> that's what it was. So when when you go too heavy like this. Once you start leaning over, this leg is like still on this side. And it's weighing you down. But when you just go right here, it's already like balanced for you. You got it. Oh. Ah! Gosh. Oh, oh. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? All right. We're gonna add some momentum. I know I said we're not really gonna, but we're gonna add some momentum on this just for fun. All right. The momentum that we're gonna use is from the the right leg. Right when you get that second hand down, I want you to just drive it. I don't want you to whip it. I don't want you to whip it how hard. Just drive it. Like I'm telling my leg to go around. That's it. Just just for a little bit of momentum. It's gonna make you go though. So be ready. Don't die. So when you initiate that drive, this is going to. It's like, uh, so when you're in two hands, that's the best time for you to think. Because that's, that's the safest time. You have two hands, you're like, what do I do? I'm gonna start. Drive and boom. Got this. Boom. Behind the head. I can tweak it, I can tweak it. Behind. Stay. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. All right, I do it for real. <laughs> Still straight back? Yeah, straight back. Did you notice when you get the straight back, it kind of like, it didn't 90 you, but it straightened everything out so that when you put this hand, you're, it was everything was already straight by the time you like put it down. All right. So there is some leg, leg movement in there too. So great. 
back. Airflares are dangerous. How's that feel? Uh, decent. Decent, okay. Remember the three steps, that's all. Three you got steps. this, you got this. Top rot. <laughs> Ooh. Come on, come on. Shoulder, it's giving up. Let's. One. Oh shit. Reach, reach, reach! Got this. Reach, reach, reach! You know what? You know what? Um, you said three air flares by the end of today, right? Yes. Uh, here, put put your hands right here, just like this. All right, cool. Don't air flare. Like, don't throw your hand until I say air flare. Okay? So what you're gonna do? You're gonna hold yourself on your left arm as long as you can. Keep the right arm low like this. Don't air flare till I say air flare, all right? Let's go this way. Open, hold your split. Okay, so hold the freeze, hold the freeze, air flare. Stay there, put both hands down. Swing this leg down. Cool. Uh-huh, air flare. Swing this leg down. Got it. Hold, air flare. All right, you hit three, three air flares.
Who should have held you to one of How was that? That was good. <laughs> I think that's about all I could do today. I did three air flares. You did three. You uh, did three. My first uh, lesson. But now I need to practice so I can do it without um, special effects. Until next time, this is Peter. You can follow him on uh, in the underground. <laughs> you can follow him in the underground. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.